What's up everyone, this is Wade with BeatTechniques.com and today I'm going to give you a little tutorial on how to organize your tracks uh, by changing the track colors. Uh, it's a really simple feature, uh, but it's really useful in keeping your tracks uh, organized. Uh, so uh, it's really simple. The first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to select the tracks that you would like to uh, color. Uh, so for example, usually you would have you know, a few drum tracks. Uh, so let's say if we had four drum tracks, what you would do is you would hold down the shift button and click uh, the end of the track, the end of the selection of all the tracks that you would want uh, uh, listed. So for example, if you wanted uh, tracks uh, four through seven, you would first click on four and then you'd hold down shift and click on track number seven. It's going to highlight uh, those tracks. Uh, now what you're going to want to do is very simple is uh, you're going to go up to your window and you're going to select color palette. This is going to open up a window that's going to give you your coloring options. Now uh, you can do it that way or if you want to take the quick shortcut you can just go down to the bottom here that has a little blue color there double click on that that will also bring up the color palette. Uh, once you bring up the color palette uh, what you'll do is you'll select the color uh, that you would like. Uh, now also what you may notice is uh, you can change the brightness here uh, but if you select the color say if you select red it's only going to change the tips of the of the tracks. Now if you're noticing that uh, this is happening uh, when you're trying to color your tracks, what you're going to want to do is click on this little button here. Uh, I don't know what this button is called, uh, but this button is going to enable you to adjust the saturation of the track. Uh, once you do that, you can adjust the saturation and you'll begin to see the color of the track changing. Um, so you can go ahead and do this. You have your tracks uh, there. Now let's say if you want to change these tracks here, select those and uh, you know you want to turn those green. You know now you have some green tracks and then you want to change these three just select these and remember you're just uh, selecting the first track and holding shift and clicking on the final track and then uh, who knows you want to change that uh, baby blue or something like that. So there you go uh, that's a quick tutorial on track coloring and Pro Tools. I'm using Pro Tools 8 uh, this feature should be available for Pro Tools versions uh, 7.3 and up. Uh, so uh, it'll be the exact same uh, process regardless of uh, which, uh, which system you're using. Uh, so that's it. Uh, once again, this is Wade with BeatTechniques.com. And uh, stay tuned for more tutorials.